free drinks, folks. Well, you call just off of free drinks. So what's it going to be, soda or coffee? Oh, what's the big occasion? No one's getting murdered tonight. Have you been threatening the clientele again? It's just, uh, put a gun to Johnny's head for no good reason. Don't worry about it. Case I'm going to be knocking me off soon enough anyway. I need another drink. A real one this time. Oh, hey, man, I know you've had a tough break, but I've been drinking until you're ready to blow somebody's head off. Probably is not the best solution. You're the only one besides my brother who doesn't think I need a public stoning after sleeping with Nicholas. I don't make moral judgments, Elizabeth. I don't like people who do. But that doesn't mean that I approve of what you did. I know. I, I, I know. It was... It was a horrible mistake. I just need a chance to make it right. Okay, well, that's kind of between you and Lucky. I love him. I want a family with him, but I need your help. Now, I know that Lucky's been confiding in you, and as difficult as this whole thing has been for him, it's brought the two of you closer together, right? Well, yeah, right, over a bottle at the bar. You know he shouldn't be drinking. You don't want him going down that path any more than I do. Luke, please. He'll, he'll listen to you. I just need for you to tell him how sorry I am and how much I need him. Please, help me make this right. Morgan's reading. Jocelyn's asleep. Good. Now that you know the kids are okay, you can leave. I'm not going anywhere until I talk some sense into Carl. <laughs> well, you obviously already tried that, and she's not buying. You know, of all the places she could have taken the kids, she took them to the most dangerous place she could find, Jason's That's past. That's her decision to make. Well, she doesn't make very good decisions when she's upset, and right now she's upset. How do you expect her to react? I mean, after all, you did put Sonny in jail. Is that true? Do you want to get my dad arrested? It's terrible if she turned son. But it wouldn't have happened if Jax had just been honest. He knew that Dante was an undercover cop and my son. But I'm not going to blame him. Because he hates me. I, you know. But Olivia, I, looking back, I just keep, I just keep wondering why I was so blind. Olivia and I broke up. I started dating Kate. She comes back. Olivia comes back, she's pregnant, right? She, I, I say, who's the father? She said, it could be a, a, several guys. She tells me a bunch of garbage. Why do I listen to that? Why do I always oh, do that? She, can, she was convincing. Well, I, if I just look closely, if I just, you know, gave it a second thought. But I trusted her. She, 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 I never thought kids. she would lie to me. It happened a long time ago. You can't do this to yourself. I know, but I always do. You know, Dante was, you know, he, he's good at what he does. He got close to me, built a case against me. He showed all the qualities that led me to want me to hand over the organization to him one day. I, I, I had to eliminate the problem. And because I didn't know the truth, I shot my own son. I didn't lie to protect Sonny. You just found out that he's your father. So what? What am I supposed to have all these, these father-son misty moments coming up? No. Sonny's a criminal. He's going to pay for the crimes he's committed. Then why say you shot yourself by accident? Look, if you're wondering about Claudia's case, if I'm going to tank it and then refuse to testify, you can dream on. The evidence is there. Sonny is going to prison. Still didn't answer my question. 